I get a lot of comments on my videos from Tesla haters saying, just wait till something bad happens to your Tesla. You're gonna re regret buying it because the repair process is so bad. Well, the day has finally come. Something bad happened to my Tesla, how to get it repaired, and I wanna share with you how much it's gonna cost. First, big thanks to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Now, before we get into the story of what happened and how much it's gonna cost, I wanna point out the posters behind me. Uh, these are posters from my buddy Arash, AKA Minimal Duck. He does amazing drone photos of his Model 3 over on Instagram. He sent me these posters and I'm gonna give away one of these posters for free to one of you guys. Uh, so stick around to the end of the video to find out how you can enter the giveaway uh, and get a chance to win one of these posters. I'll send it to you for free. So let me tell you the story of what happened to my Model 3 and the process of getting it fixed. Uh, so if you follow me on Twitter, which you should be doing, you may have caught when I shared this, this happened actually back in February, where you can see where that somebody shot my Model 3 with a gun. No, I'm kidding. Uh, no, I hit something very big. I don't know what it was. It was a UFO, an unidentified flying object on the interstate one morning, uh, flew up and hit my bumper made a loud noise. I knew when I heard it, I knew it was gonna be bad. I got out of the car when I parked, I looked at it and sure enough, it went through my paint protection film. I actually have paint protection film installed on my entire front of my Model 3. It has helped so far to prevent like rock chips and things like that when you're driving on the interstate behind semis. But unfortunately this time, whatever I hit was so large and massive, uh, it just went through the paint protection film and went into the paint. And when it goes into the paint, that's bad news. That's when I opened the claim with my insurance. I went to the body shop and got a, an estimate to get it repaired. The body shop said that it was gonna be cheaper to actually replace the whole entire front bumper than to just spot treat uh, that spot that got damaged. So this is the quote that they gave me. So it's gonna cost $1,600 to replace the front bumper and get the paint protection film put back on because uh, my insurance covers that as well. If I hadn't had the uh, the paint protection film on there, it would have been one, around $1,000 to get the front bumper replaced. The time frame is actually what people are most concerned about when it comes to getting repairs on Teslas. So I will share with you the time frame of how this went down. So basically whenever the body shop called Tesla to get the to order the front bumper, it took about five weeks for from the time that they called Tesla to, to when they got it in at the body shop. And then it took another full week to actually paint the bumper and install it on my car because with uh, Teslas and especially the multi-coat red, uh, the best is always the most complicated, right? Red, the multi-coat red is, is very difficult to match. So they actually had to paint over it several times. They had to paint the bumper several times to get that perfect match. Let me tell you, like going a week without my Model 3 was one of the worst things ever. Um, like I had to rent a gas car and drive it for a week. It was like, it was the first time I filled up at a gas station in over a year. I forgot how miserable of an experience filling up at a gas station is. It's so bad. Like I sound so pretentious right now, but it's true. Like if you own an electric vehicle uh, or especially, you know, especially a Tesla, you get so used to the ecosystem and the lifestyle of, of driving a Tesla. Like I never have to stop anywhere on my daily commute when I'm my normal driving because I, I, I wake up to a full charge because it charges in my garage, my Model 3 does. So when you go to a gas car, like you go from that to like having to fill up like every couple days with a gas gas car it's oh man like you pull up to the gas station like it's it's dirty it smells it's stinky like there's people everywhere and like i literally have to like had to answer five different prompts on the gas uh pump to like before i even got to pump gas like it was just like are you a rewards member like what's your zip code press yes for this press no for this do you want a receipt no like it was awful you don't know people don't know like a supercharger when you're doing a road trip you just plug in and unplug uh, you don't have to do anything. You don't have to pull your credit card out or anything like that. So uh, anyways, that was one of the worst experiences going back to a gasoline car. I'll never want to do it again. Luckily, however, there has been uh, some recent news from Tesla. They are starting to do collision repairs themselves at the Tesla service center and through their mobile rangers. So if this had been implemented, if this was if this already existed back when my damage was done, possibly the mobile ranger could have brought a painted bumper to my location and replaced it at my location and without me having to do anything. So I don't know, That's hopefully that's the way it goes in the future. Hopefully it gets better. Hopefully it doesn't make it worse. We'll keep an eye on that. Now, before I talk about how you can win one of these Tesla Model 3 posters behind me, let me first thank the sponsor of this video, Skillshare. 
Skillshare is an online learning community with more than 25,000 classes in all kinds of things like graphic design, photography, productivity, and business. And one of the best things about Skillshare is that it's super affordable. Its premium membership is less than $10 a month, and it's absolutely worth it because with a premium membership, you get unlimited access to every single course on Skillshare. In fact, I'm taking a current course on Skillshare and it's all about drone photography. We're talking about the posters in the background. My buddy Arash is a very skilled drone photographer. He has a great Instagram. So if you go to his Instagram, you'll see all of his incredible photos that he takes of his Model 3. So I want to improve my drone photography skills. So I'm taking the course on Skillshare. So far, I've really enjoyed the lessons on shot composition and how to make your photos more interesting by intentionally shooting with certain guidelines, such as leading lines, symmetry, and patterns in mind. If I can take photos that are just half as good as a rush, I'll be happy. So if you click the link in the description below to Skillshare, you get Skillshare Premium free for two months. Again, that link is in the description below. So if you want to enter this giveaway and have a chance to win one of these posters behind me, I will send it to you directly for free as long as you're in the United States. I'll pick a random winner a week from now. All you have to do is subscribe to the YouTube channel, hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, and then follow me and Arash on Twitter and Instagram. And by doing that, it will automatically enter you into this giveaway, and then I will pick a random winner a week from now, and I will send either of these posters, whichever one you like best, and I will send it to you for free. Thank you guys for watching. I will talk to you guys in the next one.